Now, as part of its uh, corporate social responsibility, CSR and to foster a civil war military relationship, the Naval Doctrine Command has uh, held its annual medical uh, rhapsody for the Lagos Island East community. Uh, Flag Officer Commanding the Naval Doctrine Command, Rear, uh, Rear Admiral H.D. Uh, Zakaria, uh, ably represented by Commodore Yuyu Farouk, said that the medical rhapsody is an annual program of the Naval Doctrine Command to cater for the need of the people. Um, the medical rhapsody uh, is part of the uh, CNS strategic directive uh, 06 of 2023 uh, for commands, uh, units and establishment to reach out to their host communities to see how they can show some form of, uh, shall I say, appreciation and show some form of a way of giving out welfare and then we are showing concern to the immediate communities that we are located in. It's also part of our social corporate responsibility, what we do in the military generally, and it also forms uh, what we call civil military relationship, to try to show you that uh, there is the gap between the civilians and the military is very narrow. You don't see us as are running away, uh, these people are always carrying guns, these people are always beating us, no, 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 we don't do that. We are also a friendly force. So we, are, we bring the civilians uh, very close to us, let them understand what we do, and also be able to, with that, they, they will be able to help us all in what we are doing, in our operations. Because they are, we need them. They, you have to give us information wherever it is that uh, we need to go. When we heard that they were coming for a medical outreach, a free medical outreach, you know, for a parasitter of this, um, what will I say, of this magnitude, and you know what they represent, you know, the civil-military relationship. So it was something that we're happy about, and then we are always happy about, and we are always happy about when it's anything that concerns the health of the people. So it was a good one. It's a very good one. We are really very grateful that they are here today. And the chairman of uh, the Lagos Island East Local Government, Dr. Mwibi Aladeya, uh, who was represented by the Chief Medical Officer of the Council, Dr. Onese Adile, uh, said the initiative was apt as the government cannot meet the healthcare needs of the people alone. Beneficiary of the free medical rhapsody applauded the Nigeria Navy for coming to their community at a time when medical care is expensive. The session is that, you know, nowadays, Medical care is very expensive, and they are doing it free for the community. So we thank them very much. If they can continue to be doing this for us uh, every time, we'll be very happy. Thank you so much. Uh, I will still advise them to be doing this good guest show for us all the time. We know this area is nearer to the market and many institutions. There is a secondary school, primary school and nursing school. There are very many around here. So it will be very helpful if they can be doing it for us all the time. I love it. And health is wealth. So I believe that you people, please, at least twice in a year, be coming to the community because we people, we are very funny. You can see some people are saying that they don't want to see doctor. It's a lie, oh. And there is something affecting them. But when government said that this thing is free, why are you hiding yourself again? But try to let them analyze what is free medical or what is medical for. Uh -huh by me now but with the grace of god and because i normally treat myself at least once in a week i must do my eyebrow pressure because i've get to know that i have an eyebrow pressure and i inherit, inherit it the free medical rhapsody included the vital sign check care test for malaria and typhoid blood sugar check eye examination and free distribution of musk nets among others